You're listening to the Entrepreneur Unleashed podcast, episode number 61, Biz Tip Thursday series. Today, I'm going to show you how you can streamline your planning for a breakthrough year in 2019. So stay tuned. Hi, I'm Patty Keating, and I believe entrepreneurs are the future of the world. Over the past two decades, I've built four businesses in alignment with my values, giving me the freedom to live where I want and do what I love. I'm here to tell you that creating your successful business does not require struggle or sacrifice. So how do you create the lifestyle business you love doing only what you love? Welcome to the Entrepreneur Unleashed podcast. Hello, hello, it's Thursday. Thank you so much for joining me here on the Entrepreneur Unleashed podcast. It is pouring rain in San Diego today. I feel like I'm in Oregon. It feels really good. <laughs> but I'll tell you, it... Um, it's one of those days where I just wanted to curl up and get a blanket and light a fire and, you know, watch a movie or something. <laughs> but I had a, a list of things to do. So I decided to kick back and do some work on my laptop on the couch. And now I'm here recording this podcast for you because... This topic is one that's near and dear to my heart. Today, we're talking about streamlining your planning for 2019. But the reason we're talking about that is because I do planning in a really different way than most people. And I do it that way because... I don't really have rules in my life. I believe in conscious wealth, in conscious entrepreneurship. And what I see is a lot of amazing change agents in the world who have a big vision and a big message, but they're staying hidden. I call them unseen entrepreneurs. And I know them well because I've been there feeling a little, you know, like maybe I shouldn't say this. Maybe <laughs> uh, this is going to offend people. Those limiting beliefs and thoughts that come up when we have a big message to send, those thoughts and limiting beliefs that come up when we have a big message to share. And, you know, Unseen entrepreneurs feel like they have to craft a message to talk to everyone rather than really owning their uniqueness. That's the gift. This thing that has you hold back and hide is actually your gold. They also tend to believe that they have to follow someone else's rules in order to succeed. And that is just not true. The other thing that culture talks about and people who hold back these unseen entrepreneurs adapt as a belief is that they have to struggle and sacrifice to be successful. And it's just not true. None of it. You can be a successful entrepreneur and create conscious wealth in the world, wealth that changes lives, wealth that touches not only you, but all the people that you are meant to share your message with and transform their lives and the lives of their family and their children and the people they help. That's what we're going to talk about today as we discuss streamlining your planning for 2019. So how do you create a breakthrough year? I'm going to give you three steps and they might be a little bit different than 
most of the planning steps you've heard in the past, some, some similarities, but I have a unique take on what needs to happen in order to create success on your own terms, on what needs to happen in order to create your version of success, your rules for success. And it starts with your vision. So the first step is what is your big vision? I want you to look out 10 years into the future. You can create whatever you want and visualize it and write it down. How many people do you want to impact? How many lives do you want to change? How much revenue will your business be generating? How big will your team be? These are important questions to give to your unconscious mind so it can support you in growing this business. Let me talk about move away from and move toward goals for a minute. When we focus our attention on what we want, we move towards it. When we focus our attention on what we don't want, we move towards it. What we don't want is simply a road sign pointing us towards what we do want. So don't stop at what you don't want. It's just information. Let it point you to what you do want and create your vision from there. What do you want? What's your big vision? Release the limitations that you've put upon yourself and allow yourself to visualize exactly what you want 10 years from today. And then just write it down. There you go. Step one, easy. Now, once you've gotten your 10-year vision written in front of you, Double it. How's that feel? Try it on. How big will you allow yourself to play? Now that you've doubled it, we're going to move on to step two. Step two is for you to create beliefs in alignment with your vision. Your beliefs are what allow you to create. So release beliefs that have limitations, also known as limiting beliefs, and replace them with visionary beliefs. What's your visionary belief? Who will you be in 10 years as you are living out and experiencing what you just wrote down. That's your second step. Who will you be? What beliefs does that person hold? Now, your beliefs are shaped by your thoughts about your vision. Or they're shaped by your thoughts about your circumstances. Your circumstances are nothing but information about who you were. You created your circumstances because of who you were. And in this moment, you're creating your future because of who you are. So it's easy. Who do you choose to be? What beliefs does that person hold? Write them down. Let this flow out of you. If you're listening to this podcast, you know you have a big message. You know you have something to contribute to the world. And you know exactly who you need to be. The only thing that is separating you from the future you want are your limitations. So let's just get them out. Write them down. 
Write down your limiting beliefs. Write down your empowering beliefs. And let's just get honest with ourselves. These are the beliefs I've held. And these are the beliefs I'll now choose that will align me with the truth of who I am and the vision that I have for my life. Step two, pause this podcast or if you're on a run or out and about, do it in your journal when you get home. Write down your beliefs. Remember, it's okay to start with the limitations, with what you don't want, with the beliefs you currently have. And realize and remember that those are road signs pointing you towards what you do want and the beliefs that you'll now choose to adapt. Step number three. This is where it gets really fun. Be that person now. Be that person now who's in alignment with your 10-year vision. Your 10-year vision will take a shortcut when you be that person now. What do I mean by be that person now? Choose those beliefs. Take those actions. If you know that you need a team member in order to create the vision that you have for 10 years, hire that team member. If you know that speaking's in your future, write your talk and get out and book it, even though you're not ready. That's what growth is about. Moving through uncertainty and into the discomfort of not knowing and being it anyway. That's called creation. You're a creator. Creators make things up out of nothing. So you get to be that person now. You don't need evidence. You don't need references. You just get to choose. You get to create. And write that down. Who's the person I will be now? Every single morning when you get up, choose to be that person. Choose your beliefs. Make your decisions from the big vision that you wrote about. That's how you streamline your planning. You don't have to set SMART goals, make sure they're realistic, blah, 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 blah. No, you are the creator. That's why this podcast is called Create Your Breakthrough Year. This is how you break through. You let go of all the stuff that you've, allowed to influence you through culture and your childhood and we all have it but you just let it go and you remember who you are you're a creator you're here to share a unique message that only you can share that's how you create your breakthrough year thanks so much for being here thank you for all the reviews and comments and feedback Please let us know if there's a topic you'd like me to discuss. I'm here to support you 100%. I'm here to help you remember who you are, to become that conscious wealth entrepreneur, to be real, to take a stand, and to change lives. I will see you next week. Thanks so much, and bye for now. Most entrepreneurs experience chaos, confusion, and overwhelm before they even complete their first year in business. I believe success as an entrepreneur depends on aligning your core values with your market value so you can create real and lasting success, which is why I've created a brand new program titled Align. I want to show you how to tap into your greatest value and share it with confidence, clarity, and ease so you can move into the big vision you have for yourself without struggle. And this program is absolutely free for you. Just go and register now at pattykeating.com forward slash align to join the program now.